What is up guys and welcome back to comparing growing styles. We can now see that all the plants are coming back from the topping and it was time to start transition the plants into pre-flowering so I gave them the equal amount of tree part from Terra Aquatica and some additional silicon. Aim for an EC of 1.5 with a pH of 6. Shaded leaves only drains energy from the plant and it doesn't give anything back so I use a method called lollipopping to remove the leaf that doesn't get any light. This will focus the energy to the part that matters. I had a bit of a struggle refilling this DVC every day so I decided to give it a bigger reservoir. It won't do much of a difference due to the plant is focusing on fruiting, not growing, but I understand that it's not optimal for the test. I can see a difference in pod size where soil had the thickest ones. DVC and Aero had the most and Kratky on the other hand had very small pods. When all the pods stopped growing I changed to TA final part for that crazy ripe booster. Three weeks later and most of the pods are done. Aero and DVC still have some unripe but they also had a lot more pods to start with. I really enjoyed this test and they all bring something to the table. Aeroponics and DVC did wonders after topping the plants and I have to say that I'm not used to growing soil and it has to be my fault it only got two pods. I gave them all the same amount of time and love. I hope I can give you some help with this test to decide what style you wanna try. I can't help but I love DVC. Thanks for watching and happy growing everyone.